hello viewers hope you're doing well today in this video i'm going to create a login route after that we will test the login api by generating the jw token of the user so let's get started you can see here the routes package i'm going to create here the new file with the name login.js so first of all i'm going to import here the express after that i'm going to import here the course after this, I'm going to import a login function from the login controller. So here I'm going to add the path of our login controller. After importing this, I'm going to initialize here the router. And it will be a from express.router. Let me export the module that is a router. And here I'm going to create the post router that is a login. So first of all, I'm going to add here the URL of our endpoint that is a slash login. And here we need to call a method from our login controller that is a login. Let's go to app.js. Let me import here the login route. And here I'm going to use login route. So it will be a app.use. First, we need to pass here the mapping that is a slash auth, and after that, we need to navigate the request to the login route. Let me open here the integrated terminal under the SRC package, and here I'm going to write the command to run the Node.js application. So the command is node space app.js. You can see we got an error. Let me check. Cannot find module JSON web token let's go to utils and the jwt utils let me check where we are using json web token okay so i have added the wrong spelling of the json web token let me add here the key let me clear the console let's rerun the application okay we got another error that is a router.course let's go to login route and here we need to add router.use let me clear the console let's run the node.js application again and you can see node.js application started successfully let's go to postman let me add here the url of our node.js application let me copy from here after the url i'm going to add here the mapping that i have added in the app.js you can see that is a slash auth and the url of our endpoint that is a slash login mapping that is a post and in the body i'm going to select here the json i'm going to log in the admin so let me add here the credentials of the login that is a admin at the rate test.com and the password i'm going to add here that is a admin let's click on this send button we got the response that is a invalid credentials with the status 401 unauthorized let's go to the editor and here i'm going to add console.log where we will print the error message let's rerun the application let's go to postman and let's hit the send button again and you can see here the login error that is a expire in is not allowed in options let's go to jwt utils and here i'm going to add expires in that is the expiration of the jwt let me stop the application and here i'm going to run the application again let's go to postman and let's click on the send button and you can see we got the JWT token of the admin with the status 200. Okay, let me add here the credential of the customer and the password over here. Let's click on the send button. And you can see here the JWT token of the customer with the status 200. Okay, so that's all for now from my side. I hope you like this video. If you have any confusion, you can do comment and also subscribe to my channel for more videos and hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.